John Deere LT160. Thanks a lot for coming along with Life with Belsif. Let's see what's really going on. We got a quarter pounder with sub for lunch, we do. Nothing like a freaking plain hamburger for lunch, eh? Get that in the uh, freaking right. I'm gonna have that for breakfast, actually. Who'd eat a freaking hamburger plain for breakfast? Leave your comments down below. I would. But before we get this uh, video rolling, I just the first thing I want to do is put my seatbelt on. There we go, that feels better. But the first thing I want to say before we get this ball rolling today is thank you very much for anybody that's purchased t-shirts. I really appreciate it and I'm overwhelmed with the amount of support I actually have. Just bear with me, I'm getting the t-shirt done as fast as I can, so there will be a little bit of delay. Decent, that's it. Next, we're off to work we are. And this house over here, right there, had a uh, electrical fire yesterday, it did. So I took off with a drone. I'll give you a little video action of that right here. What you think of that? The boys are just standing there waiting for something to catch on fire, but they're controlling her pretty good until the hydro shut the hydro off. So I wanted to show you that because that's what the dirty old freaking Bilsa does. That's what the dirty old freaking Bilsa does. He shows you shit like that. I think it's gonna rain today. I was told by that weather guy that it might rain today. It doesn't look too bad out right now. It looks a little dark that way. Beautiful morning, 71 out. Got a dog house. Anybody want a dog house? Come pick it up, it's in Wyoming. I think it's a dog house. I'm not too sure what the hell that is, to be honest with you. Missed out on a freaking Honda lawnmower sitting on the side of the road the other day. I didn't have time to stop and grab it. Frank, that's a $100 bill all day long. I would say so, running. I gotta clean my glasses off. They are cocked right over. I can't see dicks from dicks. Cap. So I made myself a double-double. Home brew. We'll have to see what's what. We'll have to see if it tastes good here. Let's check it out now that I can see. Hey, there you go. Freaking spit all over my windshield. What's the chance of that happening? Pretty freaking good, obviously. Girl, easy. We're just gonna roll into work here, get this day over with, and see what happens. If anything happens during the day that's exciting, I'll bring you on board. But if not, well, we're off, and we got the trailer in the back. The little trailer but you can't freaking see back there because my truck's too big. But you gotta take my word for it. Here, let me show you. There it is. Anyway, we're off. We're gonna go pick something up so I can give something to the old man. Check out the freaking storm clouds over there, Gavin. Oh, in this way. We got a big storm coming in. That's what happens when it's hot. Iron dicks. We're gonna run in some rain, Jim. Freaking right, we're gonna run in some rain. That's okay. Rain is a good thing. We need it. Hot dick. Green and Captain, the wind's behind us. We're doing good. There she is. We picked herself up a youth John Deere LT160. We got a really good deal on it too. And it even has all the rear baggers and everything. I've been looking for one of these for a while, I have. So now I can get my old man, my old rider, because he wants a small one. So now I can fix him right up. I can't wait. Freaking right, I can fix him up. It's like, can you see what I'm doing, can you? Oh, box of t shirts. Just saying. Can you see over here? If I sit you over here, can you see? Can you? Hold on. There it is right there. Hold on, let me move you down. 
That's not gonna work. Hold it up here. Frank, how about now? Can you see? Huh? Probably not. Sure you can. There we go. Decent. Yeah, so anyways, I can't wait to give it to the old man. The old rider, he'll be tickled to death. This thing does need a couple things. It needs a chute that I can see offhand, which is no big deal. It needs a little weld on the deck and uh, just some TLC. Whether well, or not, she's friggin' mint. I had to take this apart just to get it in the truck. Frank, why wouldn't I have to? Decent. There we go. Now we can take these pins out and we can slap her on the back of the old tractor ruski. There she is. So I got a little few couple things to fix. Not much, I got a belt issue and the seat needs fixing and I need the chute that goes on the side. But other than that, I got a great deal on that machine. I bought it off a small engines guy. He took it on trade and he didn't go through it. So it's got little quirks and irks and this and that and the other thing. But you guys know how much I like fixing stuff like that. So I didn't mind buying it like that. You want an extra three or 400 bucks to go through it. And I said, I'll go through it for four or five cents and then we'll see what happens. I'm gonna, this one I'll load it up for the old man. I'm gonna take that over to him tomorrow and let him have at her. What kind of guy I am. He's just too cheap to buy his own ride with lawnmower, so I'm gonna have to just give him one. Probably gonna try to give me money for it, and I don't really care. He does enough for me. But it's pretty much a day over. I got about 20 shirts to make, and I'm behind on that, so if you're watching this and you're waiting for your shirt, I apologize, it's coming. I'm almost gonna hire somebody to do shirts, for God's sakes. But we're gonna go in, have a shower, have something to eat, then go downstairs and make maybe one shirt. So that's what we do. We got a whole bunch more shirts in. I even got red now. So we'll get in there and we'll get that done. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being here. I love y'all. It's just a short one and you know what to do for now.